What's good, everyone? It's your man, Busy Brown. We're back with another episode for The Walking Dead. This is episode 20, and it's just crazy because I feel like these episodes are coming by extremely fast, and we're so close to the end of the series, and I don't, I don't like it. But still, I'm stoked. And before we start, I do want to say I am teaming up with Canada Grass. We are giving away a Stephen Amell autographed picture, and if you guys are interested, all you gotta do is follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and make sure you're following Canada Grass on Twitter, and then DM me. I don't care if it's Instagram or Twitter, but just let me know that you've done it and you're interested in joining the the giveaway i mean i'm just really excited to do this you know it's the 10th anniversary of arrow and uh we talked about it a little bit in the last video so i'm excited to talk about it in this video but um yeah i mean i'm just you know like i said the walking dead game of thrones and and, and the arrowverse are some of the shows that really got me into television um and got me going crazy with this so i mean i i enjoy i enjoy you know doing anything that you know can i guess Anything that will help have me talk about these shows. I really don't know. I don't know what I'm saying. It's early in the morning. I'm, I'm, re I'm really excited to get this done, though. But like I said, you know, this has been crazy. The last episode was nuts. I'm glad I didn't have to wait a week because I got a little. I was a little late to getting the last episode done because of uh, New York Comic Con. So I am really, really excited that we are, you know, finally somewhat on time for this one. Um, we are a day late, but still. But I'm really looking forward to, you know, hearing your guys' thoughts on all of it. You know, you guys you guys have been awesome. I love reading the comments, so do not be shy. And uh, again, if you're new, subscribe. We just started a gaming, uh, an anime channel and a gaming channel. So make sure you go to the link tree and follow me and subscribe over there. Um, really excited. We're almost at episode 1000 on One Piece. So I'm thinking of putting the reaction for that on a uh, on the anime channel. So go check that out. And um, again, I'm excited. So subscribe. Let's get busy. And I hate to say this because, you know, we don't want to lose any characters, but it's just so weird to me that we haven't got any deaths yet, and I'm just waiting for that to happen. I mean, I, I hate I hate to look out for it, but the fact that we only have a few episodes left and we didn't get them any already, I'm, I'm a little shook, I'm going to be honest. My mom once told me that the only thing Bro, I love that they're doing this. Is the living. It looks like they're going to do this for every episode. This is amazing. The oh, man. Yeah, I got to rewatch this show. We all need people Peak we television right here. Oh man, yeah, that episode was amazing. You gotta Having love season the five. to put someone else's life ahead of your own. Piece <laughs> of what we've lost. See, this right here would have got me hyped for the Daryl and Carol show. R.I.P. to that. I thought I recognized your footsteps. You know me a little too well. <laughs> I'm wondering if those people that attacked Rosita are gonna end up Would coming after like her. Those? No. Yeah, yo, Carol can take care of herself. What's up? <laughs> Get out of there! <laughs> All right, man. That's how you start off an episode. Ah, oh, shit. She should have went to the soldiers. But then again, who can you trust? Oh, they're going after Daryl too. Shit, bro. This man got Daryl's knife in his chest too. Oh shit. He turned already. Sheesh. Hey, Carol. Behind you, champ. Yeah. Oh, you should have let him talk we first. Took we took everyone. Come on. Oh, yeah, this These is crazy, bro. I'm truly sorry about Sebastian. Are you, though? Get your hands off me. Where are they? Yeah. You may There's no threat. Right now, I'm the biggest threat you have. Oh. I you say they even took dog. You think they were troopers? They took dog. Okay, now we gotta go to war. Best way to protect your friends and yourself is the sacrifice of Jean. What she wants. Bullshit. Means sacrificing you. Nope. What choice do you I don't think you went to the right spot for advice. <laughs> ah, Connie. Connie. Oh man. Yo, she is brave, bro. I'm telling you. I love her, man. <laughs> yeah. Damn, bro. My guy's just trying to do his job. <laughs> oh my god, bro. Dude's gone nuts, bro. Oh, <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, shit. We can't leave you here alive. Or you're dead. I love how she's so calm about it. I'll show you. Of course you'll show us. Oh shit, bro. Got that stormtrooper aim. 
Damn, bro. Critical. That was way too close. Trust. <laughs> also, Max. Max? Sorry, Kathleen. Oh, okay. It's alright, ma'am. Yeah, she's nuts. Then again, she did work with Max for like 10 years, so. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh. That's what Lance had to do. Man, defiled. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, see, he left that there on purpose, bro. He's like, I told you I am in the game. <laughs> Oh, this shit is personal. Oh man, it's gonna get crazy. You were right to leave him behind. He was slowing you down. Oh, shut up. It's like everyone does. I hope Dixon's okay. You don't care. I was just locked in a cell and forced to feed my colleague piece by piece to Pamela's rotter son. I might not be moving at full speed here. <laughs> All right, that's fair. <laughs> Eugene. I'm... He's gonna be okay with it too. Oh, uh, Eugene. I made my choices. Oh, I hate this, bro. Man. Are you really gonna deny them their only chance? The kind of life you took for granted? He talks too much, bro. Oh shit. It's so dark, oh my god. Terror. Oh shit. Pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. I like that. Sorry. The lights went out. I thought you were right behind me. Oh my god, shut up. We go back to the man that we found him. Did they put up a fight? So nah, Daryl gotta come through right now. Oh shit, yeah, there he is. <laughs> you should know your friend Connie was picked up earlier. Oh my god. Me. Your words tonight will carry across the Commonwealth and help restore the people's faith. And keep the peace. I hope you cause a ruckus. Hey, she knows while they're still out there, there's a chance. The opportunity to uphold a sacred ideal of the old world. Ah, uh, come on. Justice. Come on. Always seek justice. Come on. Come on. Who we are as people. these lines have to like wake you up and, and, and make you realize what you have to do. I just wanted to take this moment to thank him for that. So yeah, she's gonna, she's gonna do it. These were her last words to him. So honor the pursuit of justice by announcing my intent to defend Eugene Porter. Yeah, big dog. And unjustly accused by <laughs> Oh shit! Hi, Yumiko. Mm, uh, bitch, you going down? <laughs> But you still need me. No, no, no. We talked about this. Finally, finish him. Not burning the Commonwealth down, creating a, a better future for the children, for everyone. That future doesn't include you, I bro. know you heard me. Yeah, only because you wouldn't shut up. Yep, thank you. <laughs> Dude loves to hear himself talk. I helped build the Commonwealth. <laughs> this, I started this company. I started this company. You know how much I sacrificed? I won't make it out here. Good. You're a smart guy. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. He really tried it. What a dickhead. Yeah, she's quick with it, bro. So we're going to see a zombie lance. The end, champ. Oh, this is the crew. Are you serious, man? Come on, Ezekiel. Alright, guys. So, um, it looks like next episode is going to be extremely nuts. Um, I'm looking forward to the action, of course. And this episode was somewhat short, you know? I was surprised with how short it was, but I'm, I, I enjoyed it. I want to I say that. I, I think it was one of the weaker episodes of the, the bunch that we've got, but that doesn't make it bad. Um, I'm, I don't know, like I said, it's just crazy to me, we're just so close to the end, and it just feels like there's just so much more to tell, and it just, it's making me question, how are we gonna handle this, I don't know, it's, just, it's throwing me off, but you know, we'll have to, we'll have to wait and see what they do, um, 
We're starting off with more flashbacks, which is which have been really fun. I've enjoyed the fact that we've started off every episode since we've been back with flashbacks to the previous seasons. And of course, it's been highlighting each character that we've kind of focused on in that episode. So last episode, they had the, the flashbacks kind of focusing on Eugene. Last episode was kind of like a Eugene episode. And then this episode, we had a Carol and Daryl uh, flashback where we get to see, you know, when, when Daryl picked Carol up at the farm or, you know, when he held her when she saw Sophia or, or when Carol broke them out of Terminus, you know? We see all the, these amazing moments, and it's just so cool to relive uh, uh, these moments, you know, I guess, uh, together, you know? Because on top of us reacting to the show, we're, you know, reacting to moments we've already seen and moments that kind of made us fall in love with the show even more. So it's just, it's, I don't know, it's just ex in, extremely impactful to me that they're adding these moments, and I don't know, it's just making uh, the episode just you know so much more what's the word it's engaging i don't know it's making me like just laser focused because of the fact that they're just reminding us why we love this show to begin with you know um <clears throat> of course we have people going after carol and daryl and you know after last episode we end with people going after rosita and um we end up seeing that she didn't make it out of it but uh you know with carol and daryl being able to come clean uh of course <clears throat> carol came clean daryl probably would have gotten taken out if i don't know it looked like it was going that way if it wasn't for carol coming through so um of course carol and daryl being the, the that's like the perfect duo if we want anyone you know being out and the people looking for the rest of the crew it's you know best that it is that that duo carol and daryl um considering how well they do work together so it, it it's getting me excited um, next episode, I, we looked at the promo, of course, it's gonna be exciting, we saw some Negan, I don't know, if you guys want me to react to, the, I used to react to the promos, if you want me to bring that back, I don't mind doing that, considering that, um, you know, we, we are, with only a couple episodes left, we used to react to these episodes live, I can't, I forgot that we did that, but, um, I haven't done that in a while, and, you know, uh, yeah, I'm just, I'm just so excited that we're able to react to this show, just period, but we've had, uh, a lot of fun, and I'm just, I don't know, man. It's I don't want it to end. But uh, Yumiko wants answers. Seeing her go to Pamela, uh, to Pamela's, I don't know why it's so hard for me to say her name sometimes, uh, Milton's office, and she ends up just straight up sucker punching one of the dudes that, you know, <clears throat> wasn't allowing her to go into the building. You know, Yumiko wants answers. I like Yumiko, so it was just really interesting to see kind of her debating what she should do. If she should try to prosecute Eugene, <clears throat> if she should, uh, you know, look for justice and just do it that way you know it's just there's just so many different things and it was it was just really interesting to see um what she finally chose i was hoping she'd go with the you know not going after eugene and you know I was, i'm glad she didn't so that was fun connie connie escaping a big plus considering that you know she's been uh, uh, uh what is it called um you know uh we ha i feel like we haven't seen much of her in the last few episodes, but, you know, the fact that she was able to get by, she ended up getting captured later, but we were, I was just so happy, I was like, oh, she got away, and, um, I was just hoping that we were going to be able to do something, uh, more with her character in this episode, so I was a little disappointed that they did just kind of, uh, you know, show her, have her show up for one scene, and then straight up just kind of wipe her off and say, yeah, she got kidnapped later on in the episode without actually showing it, so it was just, I don't know, it's just, I'm, I'm, overwhelmed with the possibilities of how this show might conclude but it's just killing me knowing that it's still or there's only like four episodes left it uh, it's insane <clears throat> we have uh, uh breaking out lance of course lance is nuts it seems to gone he's gone e even crazier and the fact that we actually killed him off this episode was pretty cool again we're getting all these deaths of of characters we don't give a damn about and um i really expected to see a lot more big character deaths but we haven't even gotten that yet so the fact that we got rid of sebastian we got rid of lance these are two characters i couldn't care like they're they're decent or all right villains but it's just interesting to me i'm waiting i don't know if they're saving it for like one episode where we're gonna lose like five characters but it's killing me so um with the amount of action that's the next episode i'm hoping that there's not too much there but we'll have to wait and see but it's gonna be it's gonna be fun but yeah of course lance broke out before he left he wanted to do one thing and that's straight up to file the body of sebastian so of course when pam lsr she was broken and she's pissed like this is personal on a whole nother level so i don't know if she's gonna be upset that she wasn't the one to take care of lance but it's gonna be interesting 
Um, Eugene and Yumiko have a talk. Eugene comes out and says, yo, I'm okay with being prosecuted. I understand it's to save literally everyone else. So he's on board with it. It was really cool to see Eugene kind of step up and let her know that it was fine. Because, of course, that's one thing that was stressing her out. Um, Yumiko decides to defend Eugene. So, of course, her coming out here, her, you know, stepping up and, and talking to her, her brother and saying... You know, I just want to say thank you to you, and uh, it was just kind of, uh, to me, I thought it was, like, a goodbye thing, because, like, like as soon as she started kind of going off of, off the speech or stopped kind of reading the, the, the letter that Pamela uh, got her, I was like, okay, she's definitely going to go and start doing her own thing. She's not, you know, uh, uh, what is it called? She's not going to prosecute Eugene. She's going to come out and straight say straight up, like, I'm coming for your head or something. I don't know. I was waiting for something crazy, but... You know, um, I'm really excited to see how this plays out. I'm really hoping Yumiko makes it out because I've enjoyed her character, you know. Uh, the the new bunch that has kind of made their way in. We haven't seen much of Luke, which really kind of it bothers me because Connie and Luke are my favorite of the new bunch or not even really new anymore because it's been like four years. But um, <laughs> it's, they, they've been the, you know, a fun bunch and it's just it hurts that we haven't got more of it, you know. And like I said, we only have a few episodes left, so I don't expect to see crazy amounts of him but again it's it's a little disappointing but again i'm having fun with this show looking forward to continuing it again the giveaway if you want to enter the giveaway all you gotta do is follow me on instagram and twitter and follow canada graphs down in the description everything's there and then dm me um that you um entered or that you're you know that you did it all and you will be entered it's that simple um of course we are going to continue the walking dead and then we have house of the dragon uh another episode on sunday and then we have andor which i need to catch up on two episodes and then person of interest for patreon so if you're interested in that go over to patreon and um yeah we're gonna be starting some stuff i'm like i said i'm almost at episode a thousand on one piece so we do plan on our reacting to episode like a thousand a thousand one a thousand two and a thousand three to start off the anime channel and then we will start like with a show like spy family or something small nothing crazy because i really don't want to react to like naruto on the channel because that's like that is so much i, I would if, on the side editors i was doing this shit for free i i can't see myself reacting to naruto like that That that's just crazy to me but um also we're getting an xbox on friday so we got some gaming content coming out whether it's streaming or i'm gonna probably record myself playing overwatch 2 for the first time because i love overwatch and i thought i think it would be you know fun content to just record that and uh post that and then we got some other stuff we're gonna be checking out so be ready guys i don't know what else to say you guys are you guys are awesome and i just want to say thank you so i hope you guys are doing well and i will see you soon yeah i'm gonna leave it there you guys are great peace out